is my OOTD. This memory card is about to be uh, dead, but we're going out now and we are, I'll probably film on my phone for a little bit because this memory card is full. We're back home now and I got an Amazon package and my breast pumps came in. I got the Mom Cozy S9 Pro wearable breast pumps. So and then my friend Rachel got me the like the most comfortable, softest yoga pants. And I had to buy it in black because they're so comfortable and like loose and like so soft. So I also ordered me some of those from Amazon. And then we went to TJ Maxx. I got these baskets because I thought this would be perfect for putting all of her bath stuff in and then this could be like my postpartum little basket and they're matching so they'll both go in my bathroom. So I didn't do a proper one in the mirror. That's my little outfit of the day, little hairstyle of the day, look of the day. Now I'm hungry so I think I'm gonna eat some soup. I changed. If you're pregnant, you need these pants. It has like a wide waistband and it is so nice and comfy. So it's a little bit later now, but I thought I could go ahead and make up her little bath basket. This basket is so cute. Also, it's just going to continue to get darker. So if I have to stop filming, then I will. This is what I have for her little bath basket. I got this, it's like a little elephant shower thing because we only have bathtubs and a big shower that doesn't have a detachable water head. So I thought this would be very helpful. <laughs> how cute is that? I don't know how it works. We will figure it out though. <laughs> it's gonna go in here. All right, maybe this will go in a little bit later when we have some structure. I got head to toe shampoo and then lotion. And then I also got some more lotion, some more wash. Okay. And then of course we've got a little elephant. This is another thing that I got. It's a little temperature ducky. So you put this in the bathtub with the water to make sure that it's not too hot because I'm a first time mom. I don't know a lot, okay? So this will be helpful. And take some guessing out of it, you know? I don't wanna just be sitting there like guessing at things. There are some things we don't want to trial and error with. <laughs> we just want to be able to, to be good at. Also, we've got her bath towels. So now these can go in there. I don't know if I want to stand them up. I think I do. I think I kind of want to stand them up. We'll see. Let's look at this. We're kind of figuring this out. Setting it down. Maybe that's just the way to go. And then maybe we just build this way. And then elephant, my duck, and the washcloths. And her little bath basket is done. <gasps> How cute! And this is gonna go, like I said, in our bathroom under our sink. I, I think I'm missing like baby powder, but that can also just be put in my diaper caddy. This is organized. Yay, I feel so good about it. Let's go ahead and put everything that I got for postpartum in my bag or in my little thing. Okay, I'm gonna use these as a as a way to prop up my little containers so we can see. So this is what I've gotten so far for postpartum. I went ahead and bought some Dermaplast. I already showed you guys, but the Tux cooling pads, and then of course the adult diapers. I don't actually know how many I'm gonna need of these. I don't know anything to be honest about postpartum. So this is gonna be an interesting experience, right? I need to like keep everything situated in its spot or else I'm just gonna like forget about it. Is that all I've gotten so far? My mom said, <laughs> my mom said that the, the hospital will probably give me some as well. So I don't need to pack a lot for the hospital, if any. Oh, my Perry bottle. I just remembered some 
pads and I was like, I knew I was forgetting something. A uh, Perry bottle. Bag. And then, of course, like a nipple cream. I don't think I need to put it in here per se, just because I'm gonna have a diaper caddy in my room that's gonna have everything that I need. For right now, this is like, this is what I've got. I think I might be missing a few things, but this may also be all I need. My postpartum basket is almost done or potentially completely done, depending on if you guys recommend adding something else. Also, I found my baby powder. <laughs> this is what I'm saying is I need to go through this entire room and organize everything. That will be a video next week. I actually have that on my to-do list. I'm going to put in my baby powder. And there we go. This is the completed bath caddy. This is all of her bath items. All right, we're getting things done. I feel so good. Okay, so that's that. This upcoming week, we are gonna tackle organization, okay? I promise. Good morning. It's currently November 7th, 8.20 in the morning. I woke up at 5.30. I'm just having a hard time kind of sleeping or staying asleep. It goes a really great night and then a night where I don't sleep so great or I wake up super early, yada, yada, yada. I'm trying to make my vlogs entertaining because I mean, obviously I'm a stay at home mom to be. So there's only so many things that I do in a day. Let's make some coffee. I'm getting really good at frothing my oat milk. First sip. Mmm. It needs a little bit more. I think I'll add a little bit of honey. Not too much, just enough. Hazelnut honey latte. I'm 33 weeks today. Baby is the size of a butternut squash. That's exciting. Today, I would really like to work on some more things for the baby, like organizing the closet in the nursery. I would like to start sterilizing some of the bottles, or all of them, I guess, just to have it done. So it's just gonna be another day in my life. Obviously, it's a vlog, but let's think nursery organization and finishing touches on the nursery, because I think I could do some little extra things in there to make it feel complete. Have I been laying here since I filmed the last clip? Yes. It's the almost noon again, yes. I don't know why I have these days where I like I'm super productive and then I like struggle to do anything. I like so tired. I'm gonna give Molly a bath. This is a lazy day. It's a Monday. It's one of those days where you want to be productive, but I'm feeling just a lot of feelings right now. We're gonna try and just start doing some things. Okay, Molly got a bath. So far, we made the bed, gave Molly a bath. Now I've got to do some dishes and just tidy up a little bit more in the living room, the kitchen. I'm literally listening to Atomic Habits and it, it helps motivate me. Okay, we've got dinner. This is from the bread bowls we made. So we're repurposing these. much later now we ate dinner and now i thought i would show you guys my evening slash nighttime routine 